welcome to programming with Singate. If you are new to this channel, kindly hit the subscription button, and don't forget to turn on the bell for more upcoming tutorial and tips. Hello guys, welcome back to Laravel Hospital Management System, Part 4. In the last part which was Part 3, I have created some folders that we will be using for this project and created our first trait which will store all the created underscore by underscore id and updated underscore by underscore id and also i have shown you guys how to fill the feeable properties inside each model so in this part 4 i will continue from the table of content and complete the list so that we can have the base structure of the project so in this part 4 i will make all the basic relationships that i need inside this project and I will also make some static functions for the user model, which will be my main focus for now. And also make some accessors and mutators inside the user model as well. So let's get started. Now, inside the user model, I will first create two belongs to relationship, namely, created by and updated by. And after that we'll create an accessor and mutator for some fields such as name, created underscore at.
And lastly, I will also create search functionality for the user model. When I completed all these functions that are mentioned inside the user model, I will now continue creating similar functions inside other models as well. Note, some of the relationships are the same, such as created by and updated by. I can able to create a trait for that but, I am avoiding something misunderstanding from the new developers, maybe will also able to come across with the project, and they will not know how the relationship happens between the created by user and updated by user. That's why I make it simple and try to make all relationships visible inside each model.
Thank you for watching. See you in the next part.